Hello, see you again. So now we continue about the 1.2 number system and representations. There is a uh, three numbering systems on the systems. The first one is called binary number system, decimal numbering systems, and hexadecimal numbering system. A binary number system has only two digits. That's a uh, zero and one. Every numbers or every values presented with zero and one in this numbering system. The base of the binary system is two because it has only two digits. A hexadecimal number system has 16 alphanumeric value from zero to nine, A, to F. Every numbers or every value, every single character is represent with digits from 0 to 9 and A to F in this numbering system. The base of hexadecimal number system is 16 because it has 16 alphanumeric value. Here, A represented as a 10, B represented as B as 11, C 12, D represent as a 13, E represent as a 14, and finally F represent as a 15. For example, number 77 seven is equivalent with 4D in hexa number. Computer do not use hexadecimal numbers. It is used by human to shorten binary to more easily understandable form. Hexadecimal is translated into the binary for computer use. Some examples of where hexadecimals is used include color references, color references, assembly language programs, and use in error message on a computer. Hexadecimal notations used to define colors on web pages. Each primary colors, red, green, and blue, is characterized by two hexadecimal digits. As we can see at the table, for example, white color is represented by F and so on. People writing programs in assembly language. Assembly language is uh, as close to the processor as user can get as a programmer to so a well-designed algorithm. It is great for speed, performance, and efficiency. Assembly language gives users complete control over the system's resources. SR decimals also used to define the memory locations of the computer. Sorry, hexadecimals are used to define the memory locations of an error on the computer. This is useful for programmers 
in findings and fixing an error. Before we proceed to the next topic, you need to answer some question below. You are given about 10 minutes to answer. You can start now. <laughs> 